So now we'll walk through the implant workflow. First, we're gonna capture our operative arch without the healing cap in place. Making sure to capture our minimum of two to three millimeters of gingival data on the buccal surface and the proximal contacts. Once you've captured all of the data, select the check mark to save and end the scan. Next, we're going to reposition our arch from the occlusal view, resize that, and then we can use the hole punch and double click to punch the hole and then finish. Then you can place your scan body and just scan the scan body data. All of the data that's in green will not change. Just make sure that you scan the entire scan body. Once you're finished, you can pause the scan review if needed, and hit the check mark to end it. Next, we're going to go to the opposing scan, making sure that we capture the entire occlusal surfaces, rotating and getting the lingual surfaces and out to the buckle, mm -hmm. capturing the two to three millimeters of gum tissue again, and then pausing our scan once we've got enough data, and then the check mark to end it. Making sure that we take out our scan body, let's do the bite scan. We're simply going to do a vertical swipe capturing the gingiva where the teeth are articulated. And that will bring both of the arches to the center of the screen and that's all we need to capture.